Well, the war on ISIS means that security at home will be tighter as millions of Americans head out for the holiday. Here's Jeff Begay's. Police at Los Angeles International Airport today were armed with automatic weapons. This Thanksgiving week amid ISIS threats, there will also be a larger police presence than usual in New York. Police Commissioner Bill Bratton. Well, I think it's quite clear what we're advocating to you, certainly, is this idea of don't be afraid, be aware. A new intelligence bulletin sent to law enforcement around the country warns that there could be copycats in the U.S. looking to replicate the Paris attacks. Ron Hosko is a former assistant director of the FBI. How much of ISIS's strategy is about fear? I think a large proportion is about fear. Could something happen? Yes. But is there a greater likelihood of being struck by lightning or struck by a car on the way to D.C.? Yes. Was not Today, President Obama tried cities. to reassure the public. What happened in Paris is truly horrific. I understand that people worry that something similar could happen here. I want you to know that we will continue to do everything in our power to defend our nation. And that strategy involves studying tactics used in Paris. Intelligence officials believe the attackers conducted pre-operation surveillance. Scott, police in the U.S. are being advised to be on the lookout for suspicious people conducting surveillance of soft targets. Jeff Begay's in the Washington newsroom. Jeff, thank you.